and we have the men's minus 58 kilogram. There it is on your screen. Quarterfinals and semi-finals. And we've got about so four minutes to go. Be points and the core yeah, element of Taekwondo is a martial art is perseverance. If at first you don't succeed, please, keep it going. And that was what proved pivotal for the serve there. She's into the first ever European Games final and uninjured. And I don't know if the same can be said of her, for her opponents because they're still to get through it. Yeah. As does Jesus Tortosa Cabrera. Cabrera, 17 years old. Looks an absolute talent here. This is going to be a mega semi-final. These two look very good in their quarter-final. Cabrera, bronze medalist at European Championships 2014. 17 years old, and here comes from Germany, Levent Tankat, who was winning golds at European Championships back in 2008. Took a silver at the European Championships 2014. And in the quarterfinal, you know, in their previous rounds, both these athletes were fantastic. Tankat beat Rafael 7-3. And in the quarterfinal, we just saw, beat the Russian, Ergoliev, who's an absolutely decent fighter, five points to two. As for Totosa Cabrera, well, he had a 12-0 win in the first round. It was stopped early. And in the quarterfinal, it was an 8-3 win over the local man, Mamadov. Well, the action never stops. We've just had the most incredible women's quarterfinal there. Absolutely superb. Sorry, semi-final. And here's now the first men's semi-final. Our uh, referee is Kari Tapio Servio from Finland. Big moments for the officials, but of course, bigger moments here for the fighters. And as you mentioned, in terms of age and experience, well, Tunkat was winning the Europeans before Tortosa was even competing. So he's got that experience on him. And he's also got a different style, but he's modified it. And there's the power punch straight away from the Spanish fighter. And he's going to try and yeah. use that to an advantage. Both of them in that open stance there. Tunkat trying to fake, but the li lovely little soft shot on the inside make that three. And you couldn't have asked for a better start for the Spanish fighter. Yes, what a start for him. He was, he's picked points off easily all the way through this event. He really is in the zone at the moment. Tunkat, five foot nine. Cabrera, six foot one. And we saw Tunkat fight a much taller athlete in the Russian in the quarterfinal, Ugeliev, and just show how that distance was so important. But here, suddenly, he's been asked a few questions very early on. No, and that is the thing. Does he have the answers for it? And I know that he has the technical skill to do it. He's going to have to, here we go, this is what we're looking for. He's going to have to change things up a little bit and maybe fight a different fight. At the moment, he's fighting a mirror image of himself, but a much bigger and enlarged image, so it's very hard to get that distance right. He's found a little shot there on the inside, but his best game is spinning, getting the back kicks going. They are all bonus point techniques. He throws a punch of his own in there just to remind Tortosa that he's a live fighter in this one. He certainly is. He's the world number two. Cabrera, actually not even ranked at the moment on the world rankings. He's only really just started competing on senior events. And another point there well, there's for Tunkat. spinning top of Tunkat. That's what he's known for. I think he'd be equally adept in the gymnastics arena, which is just in the hall. And if someone opened the door, he was almost in there. <laughs> spinning away there. Doesn't do anything in the scoreboard, but it frightened the life out of Tortosa. And it is a 3-2 match now. Yeah, the Spaniard's certainly aware now that Tunkat is a little bit cut above the athletes he's seen so far. And having had a nice start at 3-0, Tunkat has... It's interesting, isn't it? He's changed his game very quickly. He's realised that if he was just going to play that waiting game, the Spaniard would pick him off time and time again. Here he is now. He's actually moving around. He's, he's making things happen. He's playing the way that Levent Tunkat has always played, but Tortosa had you know, the hex on them at the start. They were both fighting the exact same way, and you can't fight the style of the opponent. You have to fight the pattern of the opponent yeah. and not be the same as them. Well, what an entertaining first round that was. Cabrera went into a 3-0 lead in no time at all, in the first 10 seconds almost. And it was, it was Tunkat who came back and showing some great variation to his style. 
This is definitely going to be a game, and it is a major semi-final. Gold, silver medal is guaranteed for the winner of this bout. And they will play in the final a little bit later on this evening. Just showing some of the highlights here. Well, Tooncat was a little timid at the start. He just didn't quite get into his rhythm and testament to Tortosa because it was he that gave him lots to think about. Yeah. And so often it's the secondary kick, isn't it? it the first kick was blocked. We just saw a replay there. You know, the first kick from Levin Tuncat, he was towards the head, got blocked away, and then he came in immediately with a kick to the vest and scored there. Exactly. And it is that very quick second kick that sometimes is the scorer. And Tuncat showing his experience there, just saying to the young man, go back and clean your body protector before you come out here because he could see some water on it there. So <laughs> he's beginning to find his confidence, Levent Tuncat. Of yeah. course, mutual respect between the two. One of the nicest guys oh, you'll meet, sure. Tuncat, top man. The referee getting into it there. <laughs> I wouldn't be too brave yeah. at doing that. No, there's all amazing respect between all these fighters. And, and of course, Cabrera will have watched Tuncat at many of these events while he was a junior. Absolutely. And will have looked up to him and seen him on various webcasts as Tuncat comes in with a major kick, and scores another spin, point. And a wonderful jumping back kick as well. And, well, I'd have thought, yes, we're going to see it. There's going to be a second point here. There is a Kyungo, but the official is going to come because that scoring kick was a spinning kick. It was a beauty. And in fact, the referee, I love this. The referee is actually, yeah. you know, I wish referees would do that more often. Yeah. Why wait? Why bring everybody in? Why not just say it was a two-pointer, wasn't yeah. it? Well, actually, now with the, the scores, the way they are, if you spin to the body, it's three points. If you spin to the head, it's four. So there's an extra point there. And of course, that was just a little bit of confusion from the people in charge of the video yes. replay and scoring system. Yes, thanks for that, John. That's, uh, that's another rule that I wasn't aware of. So. You turn around, they change the rules. That's yeah. what it is. Well, oh, it. They change the rules for turning around, actually, as well. So it's 5-5 <laughs> five, five now. And Cabrera scoring well here and there's another hit we're starting to see this graphic in the bottom corner of the screen a lot more now uh -huh. there's another point cabrera picking up points easily almost at will now having had a barren run for nearly a full round there suddenly gone from 5-3 down to 7-5 ahead this is just how quickly points can be scored in taekwondo well joel gonzalez that you mentioned the spanish fighter very similar style, and of course, Jesus Tortosa Cabrera employing that technique as well, using those long legs. There's a great back kick, though. That's some old school taekwondo, harder yeah. to execute. Good punch from Tuncat, but the, the judges are not looking at it. Very hard to watch two people fight, yeah. And they've got their eyes on Tortosa at the moment. Well, it's interesting keeping an eye on that scoreboard in the corner because sometimes you can actually see. Well, there's a head kick, there's a head kick, and that will be three points and a Kyungo, so that's a four-point turnaround and Tunkat looking in big trouble here. The world number two has got it all to do. And another point for Spain. Oh, they're just, it's looking too easy at the moment. Cabrera scores another point. Just He just prods the leg out and he's picking them up like confetti at a sweet shop. Well, Levent Tuncat is making it too easy for Jesus Tortosa Cabrera by employing the same tactic, spinning and doing the back kicks. He's leaving the chance for the big long legs. And I'm not being critical of it, but if you keep doing the same things, you can't expect a different result, but the result is in the books there. Jesus Tortosa Cabrera, he found the answer. Perfect headshot there to win. That's amazing. Who would have suspected? John, when this second period, it's 17-5 after period two. <laughs> Is this basketball or? Oh, my goodness. Who would have expected it at all? For Cabrera, as Tunka exits the arena, the world number two is out of this event. And Spain, the youngster, the 17-year-old, he's as Tortosa Cabrera, is through to the final, and it's another early stoppage. Wow. Can you believe it? Confirmation of result. Cabrera beats Tuncat by 17 points to five and an early stoppage.
Well, you've got to get your tactics spot on. The Spanish fighter certainly did. Wonderful chop kick there to the head of Tuncat. Just take Wondo for you. Well, that is quite amazing. I, uh, if I'd have said to you <laughs> it would be stopped in the seventh with Cabrera, 12-point gap. Not with someone's experience as Tuncat because he knows his way around.